Hello friends, short video today. So I've got a queenless hive. Um, so a couple days ago I stopped by to see Brian in Innisfil Creek for a new queen. You can see her in there with the green mark and her five attendant bees. These little queen containers are meant to be put right inside a queenless hive. There's a plug filled with fondant that the bees will eat right through. If all goes well, they'll accept her as the new queen. These bees came all the way from Chile. Unfortunately, winter is returned to southern Ontario, so I can't introduce the queen to the hive until things warm back up. To carry them over, I give them a spray of water and a drop of Ontario honey. I might be slightly biased, but I have yet to try a southern honey that compares in flavor to northern wildflower honeys. 2024 is the first year queens are being vaccinated. American fowl brood is a bacteria-borne disease that has been around for centuries. It causes developing larvae to rot, it's very contagious, and causes an awful stench. If left untreated, the beekeeper must burn all of his bees and equipment. Beekeepers that I talk to land in one of two camps on bee vaccination. For some, it's another tool to help save bees and lessen the effects of a deadly disease. For others, it's treating the symptom rather than the cause. The reason why the disease is spread is because of beekeeping practices that are convenient for humans, but harmful for bees. What do you think? If you're a beekeeper, will you be purchasing a vaccinated queen?